You have entered the Plumbing Business Success Zone, teaching entrepreneurs the business of plumbing. This is Potty Talk Live, recorded live every week. Turn on notifications to never miss an episode. Now your host, Richard Bainey, the Million Dollar Plumber. Hey, 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 plumbing <laughs> pros, we're here, all right. Hey, welcome to the 318th episode of Potty Talk Live. Yes, I'm your host, Richard Bainey, the Million Dollar Plumber, along with my co-host, the lovely Laura, where we're talking the business of plumbing, how to systemize, stylize, mm -hmm. and monetize mm -hmm. your plumbing business. That's All right. right. And we are here. You caught me checking my notes. I was checking some final things here. All right. All right. We're on here. We're on Hey, live. it's good to have you here. Mm -hmm. Hey, if you're watching live, type live in the comments. Let, mm -hmm. let us know that you're joining us live. Mm -hmm. If you're watching the replay, type replay. And if you're listening to the podcast, you know what to do. Mm -hmm. Just keep on listening. Hey, All guys. right, Bob. <clears throat> Brian's Bob, in the house. Bob, Bob and Bauer. Yeah. All right, we miss. In hey, fact, yes, yes, it's honey. good. It's hey, good Lance. to be. Uh, hey, it's good to see you, sweetheart. It's well, I've seen you, but it's good yes. to talk. Be talking with you. <laughs> We just had we we have a lot of uh we have client Bo, Bo and Bo. his lovely wife who's mm -hmm. with us. We just the had our clients. retreat, the MDP mm -hmm. retreat Delnace. with the, with the clients. Yes, we're in town for mm -hmm. what three four days. Three, four days. Mm -hmm. And I uh, had a Jordans. great time. All right, the Jordans are live. Mm -hmm. Oh, we miss all you guys already. We do. Hey, Chris. We had a great time. All right. We did. All of our clients, uh, not all, but probably right. half came in. Plumbing Power Couples. Hey, right. Ashley. Right. Um, in and, uh, into Florida. Yes. Right. All right, Ryan. Okay, good Ryan. to have you and on board here live. Yeah. So we we spent a lot of time talking. Right. Aaron, good to have you in the house, brother. So, spent a lot of time talking. <laughs> all right. Whether so it's you know by the pool, do. eating, all that kind of stuff. <laughs> and so today. In fact, even even there one of our, no our clients who was saying goodbye, who was mm -hmm. Mikey, who said, I bet you guys are tired of talking. <laughs> <laughs> and so we're, we're pretty hey, transparent. We? we say we love spending the time. We do. But we do, you know, we do get tired. Yeah. And so today we had a couple meetings mm -hmm. um, that, we, that we had to, to do, right. you know, some good stuff or whatever. Mm -hmm. But um, they mostly did the talking. Okay. It's our marketing company and that kind of we stuff. Uh-huh. 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 We just kind of grunted. <laughs> we, did, we haven't talked to each other yet. And, it, and then yes. we, did, we didn't do anything about 2 o'clock. Mm. Hey, it's about 2. We're mm. pushing to 3 o'clock. Mm. We just sat, we Vegged sat out and vet, watched a movie. A movie. We watched uh, the Avengers. Avengers, the first Avengers. Just not. I mean, we didn't care. We, we didn't something care. That was I just no brainer. Just sat right? there. <laughs> Tony Stark so, saved the planet. No right. And all that, so right. No great. no talking. <laughs> um, but we're talking now. Yes. So, so we're that's good. good yes. Babe. All right. Yeah, it's so good to, hi, honey. It's good to hear your voice again. <laughs> good to hear your voice. Hey, baby. I was, actually, I thought I was going to lose my voice right. this weekend. I know. Um, and sometimes I a do great run out time. of words. I love those times. It was so fun. Guys, uh, everybody that came, we really appreciate you guys yeah. coming out. Had uh, a great time. Um, the weather was in. Florida did not... Um, prove itself to be the sunshine little, state. A little disappointing, but mm -hmm. we, we had, we had, um, <clears throat> we prayed for some, some good weather, some yes. sunshine. We did get some sunshine. Get, it's that yeah. tropical storm that's come up through the Gulf mm -hmm. that, you know, from the States now everybody you know, is, is feeling, but yeah. we were getting the, uh, some overcast and but clouds. But we overcame. But, we right. Tons of I still think we, we had a good time so. and got, got some beach time and some mm -hmm. pool time and, mm -hmm. and, and some, time with everybody. Yep. And loved great. it. great. Yes. Look forward and to the next hey, time. Hey, Kathy. So, yes. And I know right. um, Sparky just put up there, um, type the word text in the comments to make sure you get a text message when we go live because you never want to miss an episode of Potty Talk right. Live. Especially this. Yes. Hey, Sandra. Good to have hey, you here Sandra. live. Hey, it was in, well, I'm excited about We were starting a new five part series. Okay. Yeah. Mm -hmm. All right. Um, living. Yes. An intentional life. Living an intentional life. A key word, life. intentional. Yes. All right? Important mm -hmm. part of, you know, we just don't want to have, if you just you just don't want a job, okay? Mm -hmm. You're having this plumbing business is just a job, all right? right? Mm -hmm. All right, you have, have this opportunity to create the life that you truly desire, mm -hmm. desire but you've you got to be intentional. Yes. So I'm looking forward to going over these. Me too. In, in these, Something we're these, pretty passionate about. We, yes. Our very, word for the year is intentional. That's our, personal so, yes. Mm -hmm. To remind us, even after all these years, mm -hmm. okay? Being intentional. Yeah, you've got to be intentional, because mm -hmm. if, you, if you're not... You know, you just wind up coasting. If you're coasting, you're coasting downhill. That's okay, right. and that's no, not a good place to be. Yep. But today, uh, the title of today's mm -hmm. um, Potty Talk Live yes, part is, one. Part one is mm -hmm. know where you're going. Know where you're okay, going. Okay, so we're going to get to that. Okay. Okay. But so we have a question. We have a question. Mm -hmm. um, you have a spot. We want. You just got some information, like right before oh, we started. Oh yes, I did. Um, for you those of you, um, a lot of MDPers on, but we do have one um, client, Chris and Janet. Quintero, Q and J, out of Houston, like Texas. Them. Yes, um, they are now the proud parents of Alexa Quintero. Alexis, 
um, Alexa, Michelle. Oh. Yes. So Quince. Jay had her baby. Janet had her baby. It's their so first. Their very first baby. Yes. So, so pretty, pretty exciting. Big exciting so I get stuff. Pictures and all that. So we're going to do. So we, we call them Q and J. Q and J for. We, we kind of have nicknames for a lot of our. <laughs> we do. I hope, hope it's not insulting, but we we just do it that way. <laughs> we but do. we call them Q and J. Q and J. And mm -hmm. so is she now going to be A? She's going to be baby A. Baby A. That's what I think. Okay. She's going to be baby A. So right. anyway. I'm sure they're probably not watching right now. They're okay. hopefully sleeping. I hope they're not. Yeah. yeah. Hope, yeah. But yeah. congratulations to Q and J. Can't right. wait to get more pictures of Baby A. Yep. So Beautiful. guys, make sure you send a message out to them to say congratulations. Yep. Okay. Yay. Yay. All right. Yay. Hey, but I, I saw a question pop up here. Yes. Thanks, Sparky. Mm -hmm. Hey, what's one area of your life that you struggle to be disciplined? Yes. So that's our question for this episode. Right. What's one area of your life? You struggle to be disciplined. Yes, are you willing in. to be transparent to say that you struggle in, in an in, area? In mine, I'll be. Um, mm -hmm. All right, Mikey. Mikey. All right, Mikey. Mm -hmm. All right, good to have mm -hmm. you here, Lance. Yes. Oh, it's good to see you. Mm -hmm. Yes. Congratulations. Thank you, Lance. Yeah. All right. Thank so you. So exciting. Mm -hmm. Yep. All right, there. Yes. Mm -hmm. Good things coming here. Mm -hmm. But I, I have to. Um, I have to admit, mm -hmm. you know, that I hey, struggle. Steven. I struggle with eating. Wait, hold on. Okay, hold on. He's right. from where? From I'm not getting, kitchen Kitchener Kitchener Ontario. Kitchener Ontario. All right. All Welcome, right. Stephen. Welcome, Stephen. Nice to have you here. Welcome aboard. Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So yeah. you struggle with eating. Mm -hmm. That is one area. Your discipline. Even though I try, I mean, you know, we're trying to be fit and all mm -hmm. that. Mm -hmm. it, we're not it, trying it, to be fit. We fit. Well, well, we are fit. We're, yes. Hello. Uh, we'll, we'll get to that. You know, she just worded that. Yeah. We'll, we'll get <laughs> we to why we, we speak like that. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. um, but yeah, I yeah we, we're fit mm -hmm. and we do that but mm -hmm. it's the thing i have to constantly work at being disciplined at. yes you do is 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 um i love i'm a comfort eater <laughs> and I, I love my fast food mm -hmm. all right and okay. you have your um oreos i love my oreos yeah, don't be sending any more oreos. <laughs> I do love oreos. Right. you know talking with one of our <laughs> one of our um our young guns, you know, mm -hmm. not going to mention his name. Those who know that was here this weekend, mm -hmm. you know, we all and part of our, you know, we got to work out. Some of us got to work out together, mm -hmm. which was fun. Which is very fun. Um, mm -hmm. And but we talk about being fit, and that's all part of the freedom lifestyle. Mm -hmm. You know, we we want to stylize and systemize and monetize this plumbing business, mm -hmm. ultimately to lead to what we call a freedom lifestyle. Correct. And part of that freedom lifestyle is being fit, mm -hmm. so that you can enjoy the life that you've created. You right. know. If you can't, you know, if you can't walk to all the cool places that mm -hmm. you want to go to or whatever, mm -hmm. all right? Um, but, um, but definitely, yeah. yeah. So we talk about his mm -hmm. thing oh, was sorry. cereal, yes. which I can relate to oh. too, <laughs> which <laughs> I can do is having, having a bowl of cereal before, mm -hmm. all right? Bowl of cereal. And right. that's so bad. But Lance, I saw that. Lance had the comment patience. up. Patience. <laughs> yep. Sugar. sugar. I know. I know. I could. Yes. Sugar. Mine would be sugar. No, huh? no, no, no. Mine would be bread. Bread. Oh, bread and butter. Mm -hmm. You like your bread and butter. I do like my bread and butter. Like real bread, butter. Yeah. Oh, man, there's nothing better. And we all went to dinner um, Friday night to a restaurant downtown in Saint uh, on Saint Armand's Circle in yeah. Sarasota, and they bring bread and butter out beforehand. As a it's um oh. it's um Cuban Cuban yeah yeah Cuban restaurant. Oh my gosh, that like the crust on the bread on the outside, and then it's like almost uh, ice cream. Okay, butter. okay, okay, okay. <laughs> so okay. good. So that's that's <laughs> the one thing I um, am not very disciplined in when you go out to eat. And they say, "Would you like some bread?" All right, yeah, before your meal. The answer so, is always yes. All right, mm -hmm. proper plumbing. Focus. focus. Ooh. Proper. All right, focus. Oh. Okay. Yes. Okay. That, I'm, I'm being huh, focused on which, which can be very difficult. That's a good thing mm -hmm. um, if, for entrepreneurs. Mm -hmm. It's tough, and we see that with even a lot of guys. We've we had many conversations about that, that even this past weekend mm -hmm. with everyone. Okay, they're that, always thinking. Always, you're always thinking. Right. All right, and you know, staying on track. Okay, right. so mm -hmm. you got to be intentional. Yes. Which is leading to what all this is about. Correct. Okay. So so let's get to it here. Shall okay. We? You know, mm -hmm. know where you're going. Okay. Mm -hmm. That's the topic we're discussing here. Okay. You know, for this potty talk live. Yes. All right. Number mm -hmm. one, mm -hmm. you want to determine your destination. Where do you want to go? Where you want to go. Mm -hmm. Okay. So you gotta know where you wanna go. Mm -hmm. Okay. And we get you know, we, we get to we're gonna talk wind up talking about your why. Mm -hmm. Okay. We talk about your why. In fact that's one of the modules in the Success, Success Academy. Success Academy, Academy okay. which we might as well bring up now. Okay. Success Academy. If you're interested in checking out the Success Academy, just type mm -hmm. success in the comments and you'll get all kinds of information. Right. So anyway. Okay. Yes. All right, but the I but the idea of knowing you gotta know where you're going, okay? Mm -hmm. You need to determine that destination. Mm -hmm. So in our case, like with getting getting fit, mm -hmm. okay, to get to a certain weight or a certain image. All right. Certain dress size. Okay. Mm -hmm. You know, that kind of a thing. Mm -hmm. All right. You, you got to be intentional then to overcome 
those things. I'm not, you know, I'm not very disciplined at like eating. Like eating. The so bread. I got to be intentional not to eat all the time. Right. Okay. To mm-hmm. eat the junk food. To stop in at Taco Excuse Bell me. every time I see Taco <laughs> Bell. Okay. Or to eat that bowl of cereal, you mm-hmm. know, at, at night. night. Mm-hmm. You know, that, that kind of and, stuff. And um, I'm, I'm not sure if we're going to go there or not, but you have to be not only intentional, but you have to really know where you're going, not just kind of a vague idea. You don't want, you know, if it is something about being fit, you, right. you just don't want to say, I want to be fit because what does that mean? You can't right. really measure it, right? right. Or I want to lose weight or whatever. And you have to set a, a real goal with, such as I want to weigh a certain um, weight right? or I want to be in a certain dress size or shirt size or pant size or whatever. Right. Um, and then also the reason why. Why do you want to be a certain weight or why do you want to you know, be in a certain dress size? Why do you want to do that so that you can what? Right? You got to right. know. It can't just be just because you want to lose weight, it has to be why do you want to do that so you can live longer, so that you can be more active, so you can play with your kids, so that you feel um, Thank sexier. you, Proper Plumbing. Hey, thank you. Um, more hmm. sexier. You missed that, baby. Sexier with your with your better other, right? Yeah, that's, you know. that's the little game we play. <laughs> <laughs> I, I gotta, guys, I got to work on it. I'm going to lose the lovely Laura to the pool boy. You know, he's... You're never going to lose me to the pool boy. You know, he's a... You, know, you are my pool boy. Young baby. Latin lover looking kind of guy, you know. And You are my pool boy. All right. Mm-hmm. I like okay. when we play that game. <laughs> <laughs> yes, Mrs. Bainey. <laughs> <I'll clean. laughs> hey, Probably. it's fun. It's good to be married. It's good to be married. <laughs> okay. Be married. All right. Okay. But that why is yes. extremely important. Mm-hmm. And for us guys, that can be a little tough. Mm-hmm. It can feel a little... um you know, a little silly, you know, mm. why I want to do. Right. But but it's so important. So like with your with your plumbing business, okay, um, you just want to say that I just want to be successful mm. or, you know, I want to have a lot of trucks. Right. Or I want to, you know, I want to be this big, okay. You, mm. you got, you have to say, um, you give it um, a definition. A definition, so, tangi- right. something measurable right. and tangible. Right. So, okay. Yes. All right. So know your, determine your destination. Determine, determine your destination, it. okay, right. and, and what that looks mm-hmm. like. Yes. Your why, mm-hmm. okay, Bo, yeah. <laughs> She's still your boss. Yes, she is. I like it when she plays boss. <laughs> okay. I don't All right. know okay. where to go with that, right. honey. <laughs> Hey, it's fun. We're having fun. Mm-hmm. Okay. Okay. So, right. are, are you talking about GPS two? Yes. Okay. Well, that leads oh, to number two. Oh, sorry. Okay. So that leads to number two. Okay. Then you need to declare, declare, declare. your destiny. Mm-hmm. Okay. You need to declare it. That's the key word right there. Okay. So, so you want to have. You know, if you don't know where you're going, mm-hmm. okay. How do you know when you, when get, you there? get there? Right. All right. If you don't know where you're going, how do you know when you get there? Right. Okay. Mm-hmm. So just kind of meandering about and wandering around. Right. So just like in, you know, if we're going to go on a trip or whatever, you mm-hmm. know, get in the car, um, you know, and we're going to go, you know, drive to a vacation spot or whatever, we're going to have a map, right? Mm-hmm. You know, GPS. Mm-hmm. Now we have GPS. Well, you need a GPS in your life. In fact, uh, we talk about, we call it your daily GPS, mm-hmm. okay, where you declare, okay, where you're going, okay? So and, so, so, and you want to declare it as if you're already there, mm-hmm. okay? So I am, you know, 225 pounds, you know, classic body Cut. built mm-hmm. with six-pack abs, right. mm-hmm. okay? <laughs> Before you get there, mm-hmm. okay? So you're going to declare that, right? okay? I have a 10-truck plumbing business, mm-hmm. okay? I have, even though if you're just, just you in a truck, right. okay? I have... A ten truck plumbing business. Mm-hmm. Okay, you declare it. Right. Okay, and we call it again your daily GPS. You know, I'm on my clients. I've been I've been doing this for for years. Years. Okay, and I didn't make it as I just mm-hmm. I learned it from other very right. successful. Yes. Um, in fact, you know, one of my you know idols is Sir Richard Branson, mm-hmm. and he does a similar thing. <laughs> okay. All right. Every morning <laughs> to get my. Okay. <laughs> All right. That's an inside my hair. joke. <laughs> All right, but you want to declare it, okay, mm. um, every morning. You start your morning off, mm-hmm. okay, be intentional. Morning. Okay, mm-hmm. and we'll, we'll get to that as well. Okay, okay, that's all part of that. Got it. But the idea of, of starting starting your day off, declaring where you're headed. Mm-hmm. Okay, not necessarily what the goals are you're doing that day. No. In fact, I don't really like talking about goals. Some of the goals things have been so... It's not pre- goals. No one likes to do goals. It's like talking about taking a diet. 
having a diet. Or, no one wants yeah. a diet or whatever. Yeah, because I mean, it's not diet, it's lifestyle. Right. And so this is a similar kind of a thing. Mm -hmm. Instead of, it's, it's saying, what lifestyle, where, where am I headed? Right. Okay. Mm -hmm. And this is where I'm headed. Mm -hmm. And so every morning, and I've done this for years, mm -hmm. you know, did it this morning. Okay. Mm -hmm. You write down. You know where where we're headed. Right, and it's not just okay. business. You talk. Um, you right. can write down. I have a house, um, a lake house, um, at such and such lake. A three bedroom lake house with you know a boat dock or whatever. You have to get really specific about it. Yes. Um, you know what type of car do you want to drive? Um, what school do you might want to send your kids to? If there's a certain you know private school or some sort of school that that you really want to to strive to to send your kids to to get them out of public school which we highly recommend, okay. um, you know, write that down. Find, and, and not just, I want to send my kids to a better school. Right. Don't do that. Find out which school it is that you want to send your kids to, and then write that down. Right. Mm -hmm. Okay. And declare it. And okay. declare it. All my right. kids go to such and such school. Right. Um, I drive a blah, 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 whatever type of car or truck or that you're... So we have a simple, I, I have a simple notebook, you know, that, mm -hmm. that five by eight kind of size or whatever, mm -hmm. you know, and I just write in there, okay, and I write it out. And then I speak it. Out okay, there's loud. power in speaking it out. Mm -hmm. Okay, so it may seem a little silly, guys. So you're sitting okay, by yourself. Sitting by yourself. Might be in your truck in the morning. Right. Right. Okay. Mm -hmm. But you, you write it down, but the power is in speaking it. Right. Okay, in speaking it out. Mm -hmm. Okay. Over and, so, and over and, every day. And be intentional about doing that mm -hmm. every day. Mm -hmm. Every day. Mm -hmm. Okay. All right. And if you're going to be intentional, about growing your plumbing business, I want to help you. I have something Good for one, you man. here, all right, to help lead the way. It's my Million Dollar Plumber blueprint. All the specs you need to know, all right, to start building your successful, systemized, self-sustaining, and very profitable plumbing business, all right? You can grab it today. It's free. Simply type free in the comments or go to themilliondollarplumber.com forward slash free and grab your free copy. All right, yeah. so grab it. Yes. All right. Hey, can I say one thing too? Facebook is just wonky right now as far as um, serving, um, mm -hmm. letting people know when we go live and all that. I know one thing that helps are comments. Mm -hmm. You get multiple comments, and then also likes, loves, hearts, mean faces. I don't care if you hate us. All right, give <laughs> go us. Go ahead and give us a thumbs a, up, the bird, something. whatever it is. <laughs> the poop whatever. emoji. All right. <laughs> yeah, the poop. Um, all right. Yeah, well, yeah, right. Right. Um, but yeah. If you, if we would love that because we know that will help serve us up to to more and more. Lance has a great point. Mm -hmm. It isn't silly, and that's coming from a guy who's become is successful and mm -hmm. becoming even more successful, mm -hmm. um, taking uh, not only his business but his life to another level. Right. Uh, guys, this is this is not silly. This is um, this mental is mental strength. strength. Could, so, yeah, so it's a it's, it's a mental it's, workout, yeah, it's a workout every day. All right. Good words. Both as mm -hmm. I am. Uh, CEO of a multi-location plumbing company that rules the, the I-15 or I-5 corridor of Washington. There we go. Right. Perfect. Love that. Right. That's you exactly saw. right. And, and that's a really good example, guys. So, again, it's not just I, I, um, I own a big plumbing company. Right. A large plumbing company. Whatever. There's right? not enough umph in that. What, what does mm -hmm. that feel? You know, what, what does right. that you know, look like? And then how do you know when you get there? Right. Nuggets of gold. Yep. It's proper okay. plumbing. So do it. Hey, and again, as I mentioned, this isn't something I've made up. Mm -mm. This is something I've hacked off. All right. Thanks. <laughs> hacked off. I hacked. Oh, I just don't. Okay. <laughs> Thank you, Ann. Hacked <laughs> off of. Of course, Ann. Okay. <laughs> right. Yeah. Well, that, that Ann Jordan. <laughs> See, we, okay. we've learned that. See, that's what we love about these retreats with our with our clients because it's business. We talk business and, and all that kind of stuff, but we really do get to know people, um, their, personality. their personalities. And Ann is this, this quiet, nice, you know. I know she's just right. this little demure thing, you think. And From then you know, Minnesota, yeah. and she, Minnesota. she'll put it out there. She's, she's fiery. Right. I like her. Like, yes. <laughs> so okay. thank you, Ann, for that. All right. Okay. <laughs> but we also learned, too. Um, little little nuances that's going to help us that help us coach better. Yeah, like, they don't know what we're doing, but we're listening yeah, we're, and we're looking. Listening. So we now we're armed with lots of stuff for for all these guys for years. Yes, years of information. Okay, now. what you say will <laughs> will come back to haunt you. <laughs> <laughs> so they think it's just this fun little right. retreat that we get together and whatever. Right. Nope, I'm nope. taking notes the whole time. Yep. <laughs> Thank you, GB. DB. Yes, we speak things into existence. Yes, as if they already. Were, and that exactly. Is, that is biblical. For those of us that are, uh, you know, men and women of faith, mm -hmm. as in, um, um, you know, have a relationship with Jesus Christ, mm -hmm. all right, and the one true God, we know how the universe has been created. Mm -hmm. if it was it was spoken into place, right. and we've been given that same authority mm -hmm. through Jesus Christ and the mm -hmm. power to do the same thing. Mm -hmm. So it, it's a law of the universe, just like gravity is. Mm -hmm. 
just like gravity. So same you person know, you, made that law. Right. Same person that made that same right. God. Same God, right. Mm-hmm. Made that law, okay, is in place, okay? Mm-hmm. Um, the same same God that, you know, purposefully and wonderfully created us all, okay? Mm-hmm. All right? Has given us that authority and that yes. ability through Jesus Christ mm-hmm. to speak things into place. In fact, mm-hmm. Jesus said, you will do greater things than, than I have done, mm-hmm. and all you need to do is speak it, mm-hmm. okay? In fact, that's the times he got most angry at his disciples. <laughs> mm-hmm. Not at the other Me stuff they did. There's all the stuff, like, hey, don't you know all you got to do is say... <laughs> Mountain mm-hmm. move and it will move. Mm-hmm. Okay, we have that same power and authority. Absolutely. Okay, so speak it and as so, if it already were. So that's why the power. I, 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 I mean, it sounds silly, mm-hmm. um, in some ways, mm-hmm. but I can't. We've achieved everything by just speaking it. Mm-hmm. Okay, but it leads to point number three. Mm-hmm. Point number three. Yes. Work the plan. I was going to say, there is hard work involved. Okay, you got to mm-hmm. have the faith. You right. got to step into the Jordan. <laughs> you got to do the work. Mm-hmm. So you can't just be a wantrepreneur. Mm-hmm. You know, mm-hmm. we talk about entrepreneurs and wantrepreneurs. Mm-hmm. You know, we just sit back and dream about it and talk right. about it and that, mm-hmm. that kind of a thing. Yes. Okay, you, you got to do the work too, okay? Mm-hmm. So, you know, you've determined your destination, mm-hmm. all right? You've declared your destiny, mm-hmm. okay? But now you got to do the work, okay? And you got to be intentional about that. Right, working okay? the plan. So working the plan. So okay. one very important thing, yes. okay, is being intentional about what you do with your time and even more specifically starting your day mm. okay be intentional about how you start your day just don't roll out of bed guys <laughs> okay D- just don't roll out of bed right. okay snooze, snooze right snooze, that kind of thing snooze right. all right mm-hmm. um, and be be up early okay winners are up early yes okay mm-hmm. winners are up early Got and and they, the sun. and they go to get it done mm-hmm. and they go to bed early Mm-hmm. On the whole, we've got very successful people wind up going to bed early. They're not staying right. up to 11, 12 o'clock at night, right. you Scroll know, holing. scroll holing and mm-hmm. watching whatever, or doing right. you know, whatever, okay? Mm-hmm. All right? They're intentional about their time, but, right. and, but it's <clears throat> very important to start your day Excuse off. You, know, you need to be intentional throughout your whole day, mm-hmm. but it's tougher to be intentional throughout your day because um, you get Steph, into things, life's yeah. going to smack you upside the head, things are going to come your Business. way that's really out of your control, mm-hmm. all right? All right. You mean yes. I? Yes. <laughs> yes yeah. you, do. <laughs> yes, you have to work out. Okay. <laughs> Bring it, brother. Okay. <laughs> Step into the Jordan. I know you meant that right. All right. I knew you would. Andy. And the Jordans are stepping out. <laughs> they are right. stepping out. Okay. They are being intentional. Yes. Okay. Hey, babe. And the good news about this stepping forward, it's not you don't have to take huge steps. Mm-hmm. Okay. You just need to be intentional about taking the little steps. Right. So it's setting that alarm. If it, you know if you. At, at five, mm-hmm. okay, at five in the morning. Yeah, like okay? if you're used to getting up at six, set your alarm for 15 minutes early for a week, 15 minutes earlier right. um, for a week. And then the next week, set it 15 minutes earlier so that you can have time um, in the morning to do your GPS. Right. Right? Okay. Mm-hmm. So. Um, one thing that we did um, years ago, we put an alarm clock in the bathroom. In the bathroom. So, <laughs> I am not, and, a, you and I am not a morning person. I, I am not, a, you know, with, and we had the light go off on oh, the I timer. I was going to bring that up. Hold on a second. I okay. Bring, yes, we did a couple of things. Yeah. We have a, uh, an alarm in the bathroom, so it goes off just a couple minutes after the alarm next to the bed goes off. Right. Because then someone's got to get up and turn now, off the Who do you think that someone is? Right. And then we also have um, an automatic timer for the light in the for one of the lights in the bedroom um, that turns on just a couple minutes after the alarm goes off. So it bing, comes on. We used to call it the the devil light. The devil light. But that's not a very positive <laughs> no, statement, so is we it? We changed it to the light of opportunity. Light of opportunity. <laughs> <laughs> so, <laughs> so, so, damn that light of opportunity. <laughs> <laughs> so when we go to bed, right. Richard will sometimes sometimes say. Did you set the line of opportunity? opportunity? (laughs) (laughs) Yes, I did. So anyway, it just helps you get up because once the light goes off, you know, it's off. Because you're going to be tired. Yes. And I can tell you as you get older and as you're doing more, (laughs) your mind's working more. You're never going to want to get out of bed. You're just not going to. It's it's not where you just typically spring out of bed. Right. So you got to be intentional. And you got to. Just purpose yourself that you're going to do it. Right. There's no, there's no arguing with yourself. There's no debating. There's no question. You get up. Right. Mm-hmm. And that leads to the other side of the equation is when you go to bed. So mm-hmm. you're intentional. You know, we're intentional of hitting, mm-hmm. <laughs> hitting our bedroom at nine. Mm-hmm. 
Mm. So, like, we do potty talk live here at 8. Mm -hmm. I give you some insight into our, <laughs> our exciting lives. It's so okay. exciting. <laughs> 9 o'clock. Right. We're, we're hitting the bedroom mm -hmm. where, where we try to read. Mm -hmm. Often we want to be intentional about reading more. Mm -hmm. um, some, you know, sometimes we'll have a little program we'll watch um, just, you know, 10 minutes of or that mm -hmm. kind of thing just to get our minds mm -hmm. just not doing anything. Right. You get away from this. Don't. It's right. not something that drags you into, right. you know. Does it get you thinking into, about the next day or right. problems? That kind of a thing, mm -hmm. all right? But you need to be intentional about these things, okay? It's going to bed at night. Right. Yes. And it's being, okay, and that leads to, uh, you know, the discipline, mm -hmm. okay? Yes. And it's worth it, okay? This, this, is, this is what... Um, Successful people do. It, the bottom line. Right. They okay. control their day. They control okay. their time. And Most, you're the only one that can do it. Yes. Okay. Mm -hmm. Most everyone else is falling through their day. Yes. Most everyone else is falling through their day. Like your plumbers, probably. Right. Yep. Right. right. That they just kind of get up and... And kind of fall into their uniform that's been laying on the floor from right. the night before, right? You're, you're, but you're a CEO. You're a CEO of your own plumbing right. business. Okay. And CEOs get up early, up before the the sun uh, to get it done. Up before the sun, mm -hmm. okay. Um, all you guys should be up at five, mm -hmm. okay. You just well, you need to hear hear someone tell you that, mm -hmm. okay. Real, there's other really successful people, probably people you like that are even entertainers, that kind of stuff, are up mm -hmm. at four, mm -hmm. three. Okay, <laughs> that, that kind of a thing, all right? right? Um, because that's the only time you can really control, right. okay? And they're not just getting up and just now, you know, hanging out, right. okay? They're intentional with mm. um, their personal life. They're either mm -hmm. learning something, yes. okay, or in the Word, mm -hmm. um, or working out. Mm -hmm. um, I hear a lot of guys, you know, you know we're big on, you know, fitness as well. That's mm -hmm. important, um, um, the, you know, part of your, having a successful freedom lifestyle life, mm -hmm. okay? Um, yeah. And you know, they'll say, I'll work, work out, out later. Your body is just working out in the afternoon is just way it doesn't work out guys work. it's just it's so hard right so again especially um you know if you've got family things like that the best time to do it is before everybody's up get your workout in right get on your gps so you can um start your day with a more positive mindset yep so mm -hmm. all right okay so that that's the first one yes. living an intentional life living all right intentional life. I'm know excited where you're about going the next all right ones yes too. Uh, it's good stuff here but mm -hmm. determine your destination mm -hmm. Determine your destination, all right? Declare your destiny. Write okay? it down and speak it out. All right, write it down, speak mm -hmm. it out. Guys, get getting that habit, okay? Right. You're not, it's not, you're not first, you know, it's, it's not like you're writing a um, diary. No. You don't need a little you're diary with, with a little, you know, clip and a little, you know, whatever, <laughs> okay, a little lock and that kind of, okay? This is important. Big, successful winners do just this kind of a thing right right okay mm -hmm. it's a difference between the winners and the liners, the liners. okay yeah. uh, all right procrastinators tomorrow never comes exactly right right yeah. okay and again you guys started the plumbing business most everybody that watches are um plumbing business owners right you started it for a reason so right. be different than what you were at whatever plumbing company you were at before be different this is your right. company now and it's up to you nobody else it's up yep. to you to, to make sure that it that it's working, that it's growing, that it's creating that freedom lifestyle that, that you want. So, yep. Mm -hmm. And finally, work the plan, okay? Mm -hmm. Being intentional with your time, okay? Getting up in the morning and... Um, going to bed at night. Going up. to bed at night. Have a plan. Yeah, have a plan. Ha set, determine what your plan is, not just right before you go to bed at night. Think, right. Oh, maybe tomorrow I'll get up at five. Maybe I'll get up at six, whatever. Have a plan and then stick to it. Be true to yourself. Um, we I, uh, we did it we did it this morning. Yes. Quite frankly, we were a little wore out, <laughs> and we frankly. had a quick. We, we we made it a point not to ask each, each other should we work out. Yeah, do you want to work out? Do you want to work out? Because the answer is no. <laughs> I guarantee you, no matter how much you're into it, no matter whatever, <laughs> you know, at, at five in the morning, do you do you want to go? In fact, most of the time, even going, it's like we're still. Oh, uh, but when we get there and get going, it's good. Definitely, okay, yes. right. Mm -hmm. You know that kind of thing. There's just that reality. Okay. Right. So this all right. morning, yeah, we did. We did kind Steven of. Steven said, "Setting my alarm for 5 a.m." All, all right, right that's a winner. High okay, five, high five. Okay, good for you. And, and that's what, it, guys. It, it's a mindset. It really is a mindset, and it's a choice. And you're the only one that can make the choice. Yes, you're it. Yep. So, so get up in the morning, Stephen. Mm -hmm. um, you know, I, right, I hope you. You know, if you're not, you know, 
you know, I, I, yes. I, it is, it's in our heart that, uh, you know, Jesus Christ is your Savior, okay? Mm -hmm. um, really, that's what everything's all about. Mm -hmm. um, and so you've spent some time in the Word mm -hmm. or, you know, listen to a positive podcast. Right. You know, mm -hmm. the Ed Milets or the, you Richard know. Richard Bainey, Million Dollar Plumber. They're right. They're that <laughs> okay. <laughs> I didn't want to toot my own. That was whatever. a shameless okay, plug. Right. I'm sorry. Like, you know, that kind of a thing. Mm -hmm. And then work out. Do, yes. do well, some me, kind of workout. Can I say something, right. too? Again, just to have something that's positive, that you fill your mind with something positive. positive first thing in the morning um, right because there's gonna be enough negative that more than like if you own a plumbing business there's gonna be plenty don't of touch this stuff. don't don't even look at this first thing in the morning right. that's a no-no do not that and yes. don't don't check the, don't check the schedule don't check don't, don't check the right. social nothing wait okay. wait until you get to the office or when you start your work day that's the time to check it right not before you're not ready for it and if you right. don't and there may be news that you don't want to have to deal with but it it forces you to deal with it. at least it puts your mind um, having to deal with it. So right. yeah, no phone. And that's a habit. I know, um, you know, I had that for a long time where I would, as soon as the alarm go, go off, I would check the phone just to see if you know, any emails or any messages or whatever. But my mind would immediately go to, okay, I got to fix that. I got to answer this. I got to whatever. And then my day was already um, off track. So yeah, don't even check the phone. Put it aside. Put it somewhere else. So you go through your GPS. So you have your quiet time. Amen. So you work out. Whatever. Right. So so so, so, important. Yeah, so important. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay, Bob. So I'll give you a call tomorrow morning go five right ahead, to make Bob. sure you're up. Call us. All right. We'll be up. I won't answer. Because <laughs> <laughs> I'm we'll, because I'm focused on my stuff. <laughs> <right>. Okay. Right. <laughs> we'll text you back and say right. stop calling us. Right. <laughs> that Jersey boy. It's right. another Jersey. It's Jersey boys are crazy. He is a Jersey boy. Yeah, they, they, they have a little fun. bit of attitude about him. All right, I loved it. I loved meeting him and his wife. I know. Too. I love meeting everybody this week. Right. It's so fun. All right. Okay, so, is that so, it? Yeah. yeah, there you have it. Okay. In fact, this stuff we're going over mm -hmm. is one of my favorite, if if not my, the most favorite and the most important in the, the academy, is this mm -hmm. Y area. In fact, it's module two. Mm -hmm. I would have wanted to make it module one, but I think they give. It's so too fluffy. But it yeah. is. Look, you it's can know all the equations and all the stuff, uh, the right mark marketing, the right, how to price, you know, all that kind of stuff, which we go over everything in a success academy. Mm -hmm. But if you don't have it right up here, don't know where you're headed, it, it gets lost. Right. Okay. All right. But you can check out the success academy. All right. 14 day free trial. Mm -hmm. All right. All right. I give you a chance to, to get in there first and then I hook you. Okay. <laughs> all right. We all right. Right where we want. All right. That's right. <laughs> Simply type success in the comments or go to the million dollar plumber dot com forward slash success. Mm -hmm. All right. To check it out. All right. So there we go. All right. Okay. Be intentional. Intentional. All right. Life. Okay. Great stuff here. Mm -hmm. Very important to your life. Yep. Okay. Be here next Monday. All right. Continue the series. All right. Good stuff coming your way. Mm -hmm. As always, though, before we let you go, I want to remind you that you were purposely and wonderfully created, and you were created to do great things. So plumb like a champion. Thank you for tuning in to Potty Talk Live with Richard Bainey, the million dollar plumber. If you enjoyed this show, share it now. Just do it. To catch past episodes and get alerts for new episodes, turn notifications on now. And join us again for more tips, techniques, and strategies to help you grow your plumbing business.